full core exercise for you. And it's actually going to be three steps, three progressions to this exercise. Now you can either do it as a push-up to create tons of power or a strict core exercise. It's still, is good. it's still going to recruit tons of muscles in your whole upper body and obviously going to work your core. But what I want you to keep in mind is if you do any type of resistance training, um, weight training, after you do a chest exercise, I really want you to incorporate this exercise afterwards, okay? As long as you're ready, and only you know if you're ready. And you can either do it as the plank, which I'm going to show you, or the push-up, as I'm going to show you. This will just really pop out your chest and your shoulders and your posterior. I mean, it's going to work everything. But uh, it's really cool. Once you try it, you'll feel it. We have tons of guys here doing it at the gym, and they have their friends doing it at other gyms, and the feedback is just incredible. So this is what we got. 25-pound plates, and they're round. And you know how I feel about round. If it's round, put it on the ground. All right, so the first exercise is just a basic plank. And as always, I'll come here just for now. You want to make sure that your chest is right over the bar, uh, the, the plates, and your head's in front, so you're looking down in front. So I know I'm going to kick stuff behind me, but this is basically how it looks for now. Okay? So that's just a basic plank in a push-up position. Core is nice and tight, head's looking down. Feet can be a little wider for more of a base and a little closer. Challenges your core just a little bit more. You can raise a leg and hold. You can come, ha you can come down halfway and hold. Or we can just do some push-ups. You don't see it, but everything is shaking just a little bit, okay? And that's recruiting muscles all over. And obviously, it's challenging the core, because this is round, and it's on the ground. And where do you balance from? Where does your body, where is the first place your body's going to try to balance? Core. All movement begins in the core. All right, so now, we got the body bar. You've seen this before. It's round. I'm going to put it on the ground. Gosh, this is awesome. Okay, then we're going to take the plates, put them up top of the bar. Now seriously, this isn't something that if you have never worked out, you're just going to grab and go do. And really, if it's a, even if you have worked out a long time, you should have a friend there on the other side, maybe holding the plates while you do these, even if it's just on the ground. But I'm just going to show you what they look like. So when you're ready, you can try it. Okay? Pushing down in, nice and hard, my core is squeezed, nice and tight. Here we are. I'm going to go just a little wider. So I'm going to kill my shoulders. Now you can just hold the plank. You can do a leg lift. You can do some push-ups. With the leg lift. If you can see my leg, hopefully. Okay? That's another progression. So, I was doing these last week. And just because I've been doing that one pretty long, it kind of felt easy. So I'm like, how can I crank that up? What else can I do? So, because I have all kinds of little pieces of equipment in my gym, in my studio, I thought, round on round, put it on the ground. So, you ready? Do not try this at home unless you're with somebody. Do not try this at home unless your core is really, really strong. Okay? Balls on plates. This really is like, you have no idea how exciting and fun this is. Okay? Push in. Pushing down, my chest is right in the line and my head's in front. I'm going to step up as I'm pushing down. Creating tons and tons of core strength. Now I can just hold, or, well I just hold when you can move. Big breath out on the exertion. This feels so good. It's round, on round, put it on the ground. Please be careful. 
You can also do these on the body bar. I won't waste, uh, too, much, uh, waste too much more of your time to really crank up the core strength. It's all upper body, working the posterior, the anterior, so front and back, lots of core. It's going to pull out tons of muscle. And if you're an athlete and you need power, nothing beats working your core. Thanks a lot, Barry Lovelace from BarryLovelace.com. Make sure you subscribe to all my YouTube videos. You never know what I'm going to send you. And also, if you're local in the Lehigh Valley, please check out my gym website, www.fitquestlv.com. Okay? There are no salespeople here. You're not going to run into somebody that works on commission alone to have you sign a piece of paper to join our gym. Okay? Trust me, there's no high pressure sales. Please stop in. We have a really friendly staff. We have great instructors, the best instructors in the whole Lehigh Valley. What else can I say? I'm very lucky to have them. Thanks a lot and have a great day.